Amen. Today I want to talk to you about Proverbs 23, verse 4. It says, Do not overwork to be rich. Because of your own understanding, cease. Now look, this is not a verse that gives you an excuse to be lazy. We're called to be providers. Uh, we're to provide for our families. So I'm not talking about don't work, lay around on the couch and do nothing. Uh, in fact, the Bible says if a man won't work, that he shouldn't eat. But what I want to talk about is guys who are working two and three jobs just to have things. You know, the fancy car, the boat, maybe a fancy house, all those kinds of things. There's some people, they just want to have the appearance of success. There's other things, they're just driven to have things. I have a pastor friend that lives in a wealthy community, and he was showing me these big, beautiful homes. And a lot of them would have a luxury car in the driveway. And he said, you'd be surprised how many of these people will call me asking for food. And when I pull up, I think, surely these people don't have any financial problems. But he said, they let me in the house and there will be no carpet, sometimes not even any furniture. They're laying on the floor, they're sleeping on the floor, they're, they have absolutely nothing because everything they make is put into the appearance of being successful. Guys, if we're driven for things, that's no way to live. Things will never bring happiness. True happiness comes from serving the Lord. And we need to have priorities. So I want to challenge you to have priorities in your life. First of all, God needs to be first place in your life. Secondly, spend some quality time with your wife. Send, spend quality time with your children, with your family. Listen, you need to know not only to be a good worker, but you also need to know when to rest. It's okay to rest. It's okay to take some family time. So don't be driven by things. Don't be driven to get that fancy, shiny object. Serve the Lord. Put Him first in your life. God wants you to be blessed. He'll help you to be blessed. But don't serve things. Serve God.